South Korea's Korea Football Association is considering appealing to FIFA or the Asian Football Confederation over the recent controversial Inter-Korean World Cup qualifier in Pyongyang. The compliance comes as the AFC's manual states that the hosting country should allow entrance of traveling supporters and media to conditions that the North failed to comply with. Lee Min Sun reports. The historic Inter-Korean World Cup qualifier in Pyongyang on Tuesday was a blind game of sorts for South Korea with no live broadcast of the game and no fans in the stadium. There is also a rising wave of criticism regarding North Korea's unprofessional handling of the match. Soon after full time, the Asian Football Confederation explained it could not take issue with Pyongyang not allowing in any fans as the hosting country has full rights over home game marketing. However, the AFC's competition operations manual states otherwise. According to this year's edition, the hosting organization should ensure visas and entry to the AFC delegation, traveling team's official delegations, media and traveling supporters without any discrimination. This particular clause shows North Korea clearly violated the AFC's guidelines. South Korea's Korea Football Association is closely reviewing the manual as it specifically states the entrance of media and traveling supporters should be permitted. However, it's unclear whether an appeal would have any practical result because it's not one of the AFC's binding rules. The KFA is also reviewing the team's three-day stay in Pyongyang to see if there were any violations of match operations or international regulations that need to be raised with the AFC or FIFA. Meanwhile, some video clips of the match was released on Thursday. The KFA initially planned to televise the clips but uploaded the highlights on its website instead because a low-quality video was not suitable to air on TV. Lee Min-sun, Arirang News.